Enough time has passed since Burger King entered the chicken sandwich war for the luster of the chicken to be somewhat tarnished. An employee on Reddit posted a complaint about the difficulties involved in preparing the chicken. Namely, the glaze is aggravating to apply, and because of the amount of breading it carries, the patty does not always cook all the way through. Furthermore, its size means only three can be cooked per basket, and Burger King restaurants typically only have two fryers with two baskets each. This means that, at most, you could only have a total of 12 chickings cooking at a time. In that Redditor summary, the chicken is the bane of my existence. While no one came out to argue against this claim, others expressed that the sandwich is delicious, making it worth the trouble. Some suggested that it might not be a good idea to talk trash about the only good food offered by the burger chain. For Burger King, however, the chicken's breading is the very thing that sets it apart from competing sandwiches. In a statement shared by Thrillist, the fast food company explained, We've mastered the process, ensuring that every freshly hand-breaded chicken filet has a bite that's crispy on the outside and juicy on the inside. So, considering that Burger King is purposely making the sandwich this way, one disgruntled employee and a few other annoyed workers probably will not deter the restaurant group. The importance of the chicken to Burger King seems hard to overstate. On June 17th, CNBC reported on a change in approach that was detailed by Jose Sill, chief executive of Restaurant Brands International, the company that owns Burger King. Mainly, it was decided that the chicken would represent Burger King's pivot from a focus on promotional concerns to fundamental ones, like preparing meals worth promoting meals that people would want to order. When discussing the addition of the chicken to the Burger King menu, Sill said, I think the development of that product and how we've launched it should be an indicator of how we're thinking about and reprioritizing the business at Burger King. The chicken may well serve as a symbol for the chain's rebranding efforts, which extend to the updated exterior design, menu boards, and logos. All these considerations were, no doubt, spurred by the sandwich's near-universal praise, including positive reviews from Thrillist and Insider. The popularity of this item has gone so far that some feedback suggests the success of the chicken could even surpass that of the Whopper. With such a hit, Burger King may decide to restructure its kitchens to alleviate the stresses of cooking the chicken and, more importantly, ensure that it is actually cooked all the way through. In response to Burger King's promotional advertising for the chicken, one Reddit user wrote, Saying it's better than the Whopper? That's your product. Why do you go out of your way to essentially trash your headline product? And they might be right. One Burger King advertisement is titled, Ignore the Reviews, Get a Free Whopper, referencing reviews claiming that the chicken is the best item on the menu. Then there's the nightmare ad, in which the king is haunted by a terrible dream where the chicken has dethroned the Whopper. Flame grilling used to be your thing, but now... Chicken. As you can see, Burger King insists that the chicken is not only worth the years of development, but also worth any risk the chain might take. Burger King's timely decision to look beyond the burger is a brave and noble move. But no matter how badly it wants the cutesy product name to catch on, it's called Burger King, not Chicken King. Even with all the success, it still has not received the universal praise you might expect. Eat This, Not That, for example, ranked five fast food chicken sandwiches, and Burger King's new edition took last place. Many customers have also shared some negative opinions on Reddit. Perhaps when the luster fades, the fad will finally fizzle out. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more MASH videos about fast food are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.